it's me welcome to beta day five so I recorded another video for today that I was gonna post today and I was not happy with it so I'm going to record it another day because it's going to require a little more time and stuff so it's a vlog today I don't think there'll be any organizing in this vlog because I really have nothing else to do right now that I want to do we opened the opera tonight I'm very excited about that so I'll give you guys a backstage tour if you want to see that, but the only thing is I have to get the footage edited and all that stuff before midnight tonight in order to be Veda. So therein lies the challenge. So that's the scoop. That's the scoop. Uh, I can't have my hair like this when I go to the opera. I have to put a wig cap on. It's going to be super, very much attractive. And I'm going to be wearing a wig just like last time. So we will hang out. What I'm doing right now is I just finished my lunch. I was feeling a little bit um, queasy. I don't know why, but I took some peppermint pill and now I'm feeling a little better. I had to sort of relax. I think it might be anxiety related. I do have some issues with, I'm just an anxious person. So the uh, gut and the brain anxiety sort of, they go together, unfortunately. So every time I'm feeling a little anxious, I get a little gut upset too. And that, that then that makes me more anxious. Do any of you guys experience that? I am, I, it, they're attached and they're not friends. The main thing I should be doing is getting ready for tonight. I have to pack up all of my makeup for tonight, figure out what I'm gonna take. I forgot my contour kit last time, which is a disaster. I do have to clean my beauty blender. <laughs> I'm watching Claire Siobhan on the TV, on the big Apple TV. Whoops, you can see there. I'm watching a Sims 4 video because it just she just makes me so happy. She's almost at a million subscribers. That girl is like making stuff happen. But while I'm watching this, I'm gonna grab my brushes, gonna give them a good clean and get ready to pack my makeup bag for the theater. to pack them up, but I actually should go to Target. You know why? We are dangerously close to being out of toilet paper and that is an issue. We also don't have dishwashing soap. I don't have fabric softener. I just need some other things as well. So I'm gonna go to Target, do a little shopping. Oh, we'll do a little Target haul, how fun is that? 12 seconds later. It was so windy outside. Woo, it's freezing also. It's not spring, no. Super exciting Target haul. Get excited. All right, this is the most boring Target haul of, of all time. Look, toilet paper, smelly fabric softener, Doug Doug wipes, kinky curly curling custard. You guys have no idea how much I hate buying this because it's so ridiculously expensive, but it is the best gel on the market. It doesn't dry my hair out and it just, it's so good, but it's, it's like $17 a bottle. I hate that. I bought two Mrs. Meyers dish soaps. I got the mint. This is a limited edition, I guess, for spring. But to replace the soap we were out of immediately, I went for radish. I don't know if this is limited edition or if this is like hard to find. I was only able to find the hand soap uh, and the, the dish soap, but you guys, I am all about that radish life. I know it's not everybody's cup of tea, but I think this smells so good. I love it. I, I love it a lot. And lastly, I got some arch supports for my opera shoes. They are super flat. What? What? They are super flat, so I'm going to use these and then I'm going to take them home. And you know what, I have never actually, I don't think I've showed you guys where I keep my clothing maintenance stuff. I will show you that right now. Wow, wow, what, what, why, wow. What do you do, what? 
In my little cabinet, I have this little drawer, and it's buttons clo and clothing maintenance tools, and it has all of my shoe stuff on it, as well as things to fix clothing. And it looks like I was actually in this bag the other day. This is where I was keeping a bunch of my shoe stuff, and this is so embarrassing. So I had this out, right? And I was like, oh, looking through, because I was looking for some art support. So I dumped this out, and excuse me, sir. So I jumped this out and I found like this guy and I found one arch support and then like a couple of these back things to have your shoe stop hurting your heels and then like a pair of these, these are okay, and then a heel that I need to put back on one of my shoes. I, I, like why do I have singles? I, these are like not, why, why, why? Anyway, in this box I have all of the clothing maintenance things. I've got a bunch of buttons in here particularly sure why these buttons are in a bag, but you know, we won't worry about that right now. A lot of the times when you buy stuff from Anthropology, the extra button would come in a little sachet that was the same pattern as the shirt. So I basically just saved all the little sachets with the buttons in them. I also have all of my shoe maintenance things in here. Got some rain and stain guard back there, a little sweater, shaver. I got some boot stuff. I've got all kinds of just clothing maintenance stuff in here. So it's not super neat in here, but you know what? It's all in one place and that's really all that matters. What are you doing? You're, what? This is your bed now? Okay. So I'm gonna pack my makeup bag for the opera tonight. So I'll show you guys what I'm bringing if you're interested in something like that. Uh, I'm bringing this NARS Velvet Matte Skin Tint foundation. This is uh, my only liquid foundation. It's really nice. I like it a lot. I am in the cover. I'm in the cover. I'm in the color Cuba and I'm going to pack that as my base. And then I'm actually going to pack also a powder foundation. This is the Laura Mercier powder foundation in the color 15. That there's the info. I don't know. I'm going to pack two eyeshadow palettes. One is the Master Palette by Mario. You can't get this anymore. It's limited edition, but it's one of my favorite eyeshadow palettes. And I'm also going to take the self, wait, no, this is not the self-made palette. Hello, excuse me. The World Traveler Palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And it is also limited edition. Can't get it anymore. Sorry. Also pack in a blush. This is the NARS I think unfiltered blush palette. So I've got many color choices. If I like this is the unfiltered one. I'm gonna put that in there for my blush. And I'm gonna pack a contour kit, which I forgot last time. This is a Smashbox contour kit in like the medium deep. This is gonna be, on the stage is really the only time when I contour at all. So I'm really excited to get to use that. I am also taking a couple of brow products. I'm gonna bring this one and my brow is the little, the spoolie. That was on my brow is actually came off. I'm really disappointed in that, but you know, whatever. But there's nothing like the brow is. If you guys have never tried it before, it's amazing. And I'm going to take two eyeliners. This is a lip, this is a pencil eyeliner and this is a liquid eyeliner. I'm gonna bring my L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise Mascara. To be honest, this is not my favorite mascara. It's, it was the one that everyone was like hyping up on YouTube and it doesn't work as well as the Too Faced better than you know what mascara, but you know what? I'm gonna use it up. Gonna bring my little professional primer. Gonna put that on my face first. Gonna bring some, what is this, moisturizer? <laughs> because I'm gonna need to take off some makeup, so I have my little like wipes here. I do have some micellar water that I left at in the dressing room, so I'm gonna use that to take off my makeup. But I'm also gonna bring some rubbing alcohol in a little spray bottle. I might want to fill that up a little more. Anyway, put those in there. And I'm also going to bring some concealer. This is Benefit Erase Paste. Not the hugest fan of it. I don't use concealer very much, but I do use it on stage because, you know, you know. And <laughs> I got my wig cap. So I'm, I'm going to pack some brushes and I am going to put this away. I'm going to put the wig cap on actually before I leave the house. And I'm just going to wear like a scarf on my head to the theater so I don't look like a total crazy person walking around with a, with a wig cap, you know what I mean? So uh, I'm gonna do that. Spring will be a little late this year. So before I fully start to get ready, I think I'm just gonna take Clover on a quick 30 minute walk or something like that, just so he gets a little more exercise. He was half in front of the park this morning, but we're gonna be gone all night long, so he's gonna be here by himself, so I want him to be nice and tired. And he's looking a little bit antsy, so we're gonna go for a nice little stroll. April of old, 
Why do you put shoes on your dog? Because this. How are his feet so dirty? Look, now he's on the couch. I don't even care because we're in our place's couch, but look. Look at the dirty feet. So during the walk, I was just doing some super intense, deep thinking about the video that I shot and I spent probably an hour shooting and editing and just being really unhappy with it and having to reshoot it tomorrow. If you are a YouTube content creator or if you want to be a YouTube content creator, I think instances like that are totally okay. The first 100 videos I shot for my channel, this channel, I don't think are really that good. I think that, that you get better the, the more you do it. So if you have ever wanted to start a YouTube channel or if you are thinking about starting a YouTube channel, just do it. Don't have the fear of gear. You can start with your iPhone. I shoot B-roll with my iPhone all the time and it turns out great. Um, don't worry about having a fancy camera. Don't worry about having fancy lighting. Daylight is the prettiest lighting, so just shoot your videos during the day, you'll be fine. If you can't, that's okay too. Just go out there and get started, do what you wanna to do today. There's something to be said about showing up, and that's really, I think, what Veda is about. The vlog every day in April is just about showing up, so I think this is gonna be the most boring vlog of all time, but hey, I showed up. So I will take you guys on a tour of the theater tonight, and I will post that video tomorrow because I don't think I'll have time to edit it and post it by tomorrow. But I promise I'll take you guys backstage tour, opening night at the opera. I don't know if that's something you're interested in, but I'm gonna post it anyway because it's beta and it's vlog every day in April and I gotta have something, right? Something. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do something with my hair. I'm gonna wet it and put it in some pigtails. And I will see you guys in the next video, which will be tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Stay neat. Oh